Hi guys, I'm Todd Christ from Seri Brewing Company and today we're doing another Chuck Wines. And by today, this is my third one. <clears throat> Again, we'd like to give a shout out to the Maryland Department of Agriculture, which is Maryland's best seafood resource, or not resource, program. I'm sorry, I'm still sweating really bad from earlier. The Walrus Oyster and Ale House right in Columbia for donating all the oysters and oyster cover program. This is Megan from there, and she is fantastic. She's been shucking all day. Shucking, shucking, shucking. You probably saw her in the last couple of videos. God, why, why am I doing this? I have no idea. Anyway, this is Dave. He owns Brewery Fire out in Tawny Town. Tawny Town, right? Yeah, Tawny Town. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Okay, you didn't good. say Tawny Town. You won. Thank God, I almost did. I almost said Tawny Town. I don't want to do that. So, we are gonna eat some hot sauces. Yeah. I'm sure that you know exactly what we're gonna do. Yeah. Um, I want to ask you questions. Too. Yeah. It's fun. I'm gonna ask you questions. You're gonna eat hot sauces. We can add more. You don't have to. You don't have to add more. I did it last last one and I. I think I bit off a little bit more than I could chew, but I'm gonna try it again. Okay. So, uh, very first sauce that we are doing is going to be the Dahlia Onion Hot Sauce by McCutcheons in Frederick, Maryland. These guys have another one on here that starts getting really hot. It's gonna suck. Um, anyways, Maryland hot sauces or like tri-state hot sauces. Okay. Maryland chicken because I can't eat 50 oysters. I can, but I'll throw up. You don't want to see that. And then Maryland's uh, source oysters. Okay, first question is going to be, what is your favorite beer and why? He's only eaten oysters twice in his life. This is brand new. This is like the first time ever. This is fun. Yeah. I was telling Ty, I'm more afraid of the oysters than the hot sauce, but we'll see how it goes. Um, so favorite, so favorite beer? Like, favorite beer, period. Period. Uh, lunch by Maine. Main Beer okay. Company. Yep, yep. Um, I mean, here we go wrong. Yeah, right. um, that was kind of an eye-opening IPA, um, just super clean. Everything they do is just outrageously clean yeah. and no weird flavors, no nothing, just good, clean, simple good. beer that, that will blow your mind. I exactly. Think. They don't do anything that's crazy at all. No. They're just like straight, straightforward, wiry, small tops. Yeah. And it's just delicious. Oh, yeah. Like, Everything I, they do. Yeah. And a new brewery is like super, super self sustaining too. Like it's like yeah. it's like a, a a zero net carbon footprint or whatever. Yeah, it's they're, they're, they're awesome. And I'm just going to have a trip planned this year, but. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Next year. COVID. Yep. I think COVID. God, here we go. All right. Yeah. Sauce number two is Mambo sauce. Uh, which is at a capital city, um, which is in DC. This one's actually really good. It's nice yeah. and sweet, little, little, little tangy tang. Okay. Um, yeah. So, oh, God, these are big chunks, Abby. Full, but now I'm eating more chicken. All right, here we go. Oh, question number two What's your macro beer guilty pleasure? Does a uh, Guinness draft count? Yeah, I, okay. I guess it does. Yeah, I mean, you know, I know Guinness has their Maryland presence, which is amazing, what? but you know, that was kind of my gateway drug into a good beer. Yeah. So, um, okay. I mean, just a, a draft nitro Guinness is amazing. Yeah, so, I agree with you. Yeah. That'd be great to have right now. It would be really good right now. <laughs> third is Jamma. 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 Jamma Jamma. I, I don't know. I'm, I, it's the third time and you think I don't know how to say it, but uh, I have no idea. I'm going to okay. say it different every time. I'm going to say Jamma this time. Okay. We're going for some Jamma. Next time I'm going to say Jamma. Hey, guys. Jake from Broho Sauce here. So we're a craft hot sauce company based out of the Glen Burnie area just outside of Baltimore. It's my brother and I, and we've been making craft small batch hot sauce using fresh ingredients, local farms, things like that for a couple years. And uh, recently we've teamed up with the Brewers Association of Maryland, which is a really cool operation that supports all the local breweries in Maryland. And we decided to collaborate with uh, one of those breweries, Idiom Brewing Company out of Frederick, and we're making a beer, or making a hot sauce featuring one of their beers. Uh, it's a fruited sour, so we're gonna make a hot sauce called Gut Punch, and it's gonna feature habanero peppers, uh, raspberries, blueberries, and blackberries, just like their fruited sour, and it's gonna be pretty spicy, but it's gonna be really tasty and feature lots of fresh local ingredients. And you can pick this up on our website. It'll be advertised on BAM's website as well, but our website is www.brohosauce.co. We have lots of other tasty hot sauces you can pick up there as well. Um, <clears throat> this is at a Broho Sauce in, in uh, Glen Burnie. I have no idea where these guys are, so I love Glen Burnie. Okay. And I keep on seeing Glen Burnie pop up and I'm like, sweet. Hell, is there? Because when we get up in here, you're gonna be like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm nervous about. A couple oh of yeah, I'm really nervous. 
What is your most embarrassing beer story? Eat first. Do whatever you want. Let your little your little mouth be okay. That's all. Or not okay. Not okay. Just yeah. What don't, don't the hell does her mouth. Okay, this one, this is like a smoothie kind of thing. It's like, okay. you know, it's like sweeter. Yeah. And this one's just like, I have peppers in me. Yeah. So most, most embarrassing beer story. So I live in Carroll County. I'm not from there. Um, I grew up probably 15 minutes from where we are right now. I grew up on the 95 corridor. I'm not a country guy. I didn't grow up with land or anything like that. So at a party out even further in the country than my brewery, um, guys busted out four wheelers. Now I've never ridden anything with four wheels other than a car in my life. Right. But you know, five beers in, you get that courage. Oh, yeah. So yeah, um, right. you know, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to use this thing on my buddy's property, and we're you know, coming in. I'm kind of following his lead, and I take this turn, and not knowing what I'm doing, my foot catches on the the wheel that the power goes to. Oh no. Just throws me. Completely throws me. I land on my back. I'm in pain for three weeks. Wow. Just trying to keep up with the people that know what they're doing. And it's all because you had five, six years. Yeah. So don't operate an ATV after. Uh, you alright, man? <laughs> yeah, I'm just thinking about. I'm just thinking about things coming up. <laughs> so the next sauce is called Screaming Hornets. Yeah. This is out of the Abrojo people out of Epping Glen Burnie, son of a dicks. You know what? Let's do it. Want to add a little more? Oh, this is, yeah, this is the, okay. Yeah, yeah. Screaming Hornets. Yeah, yeah. Screaming Hornets. It says Screaming Hornets, it has to yeah. be one, you know? I mean, it's not Whispering Hornets. No, no it's, yeah, you're right. If it was called Whispering Hornets, I would be like, this is going to be delicious. Yeah. Oh, wow. It says Tasty as a Hornet <laughs> Whispering. That's how I know it's yeah, a fine tasty, all beer. Tasty as a Hornet Oh, That's God. Whew. Okay. All right. If he could do away with one style of beer, what the F would it be? Oh, we all know the answer. Uh-huh. Shame one or Oh, God, why are I doing mm. We did a thing. Fruit of sours. Come on. Fruit of sours. All right. All right. It's fine. It's fine. Why? Huh? You're allowed to love them. Yeah. Um, I just enjoy. don't be surprised if most brewers hate them. Yeah. You know, or at least hate making them, or hate the headaches that come with them. We talked about that earlier. Yeah. But the headaches that come with fruit of sours. Yeah. Sometimes, almost that way, even doing them. Yeah. But you know you're going to make money on the fruit of sour as a business. But you also know you're going to have to deal with a bunch of crap that comes with the fruit. Well, yeah, because you have to pick one lane. Are you going to go super, like, smoothie style yep. and then have to make sure that the product's kept cold yep. forever? And then be labeled as, oh, it's a brewery that's irresponsible. Right. But right. people when, want that beer. Right. So you're not responsible for, for what someone does with their product. Right. right. Have it. Exactly. Or you can go the other lane where, well, I'm not going to get those flavors, but it's going to be shop stable. Right. You, you, you can't split. you got to pick a, pick a lane. And it, it's, it's a difficult style it to do that. It, it, it really is, and that's, that's one of the things is that <clears throat> they're really hard to make. They're not really that hard to make. They're hard to keep cool. They're hard to, there's a lot of things, but right. they also, as a business, they make you money. So it's like, yeah. F, I don't care. Yeah. All right. All right, so this one's fine. Okay. This one's Old Bay hot sauce. We all know where that comes from. It's right from Maryland. I mean, obviously, it's Maryland's Old Bay. Yeah, let's just say this. Okay. Yeah, I'm doing good. Thanks. Thank you, Jason. There's for some double ones in the back. All right, cool. Jason Mellicans in the back. He's one that owns Molly. He is a horrible work. Hmm. So if you're quarantined for four months, what is one beer style you would drink all the time? Chuck Palmer. Super crisp and clean. There's a lot of things that we all are saying that well, it's the same thing. Yeah. All the time. It's amazing that you know once you're in the industry for a little bit, your whole mindset changes. Like if you ask me. Like, if I was quarantined three years before opening a brewery, right. I would have, you know, gone West Coast IPA or Imperial Stout or, you know, the yeah. highest ABD I could think of. Yeah, exactly. But now I just want something crisp, clean, refreshing, five-ish percent. Yeah. yeah. Low ABD is what I like, which is why I drink bourbon shrimp. Low ABD is, is really a good drink. <laughs> Straight bourbon? Is that what you just said? Yeah, I did that. Okay, yeah, me too, yeah. I, uh, I didn't realize whiskey was an option because I would have gone to Scotch. Oh, oh okay, well, right. there you go. Right, I yeah. mean, it's not an option, but I just wanted to throw in that I like to down bourbon. Okay, and I like to down Scotch. We could be friends. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Next hot sauce is Goblin Arrow. Is <laughs> Broho again? Eh, probably. Who is it? No, it's, um, yeah, it's Eckerd Broho. Eckerd Broho. God, you Can we do it a little more? Yeah, All we right. have to. Wow, I am punishing my... What did I do to myself? I don't know. I don't know you why want I hate myself. You're putting more sauce on something. You 100% did. Oh, oh. 
son of a dick. It's liquidy. Yeah, little bro. He's yeah. like, it's a demon goblin laughing at me. Yes, it is. He's literally saying, you know what that, you know what that picture is? That's, me. That's future you. Yeah, that's future name. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Why do I do this myself? I keep on, you know what? Every every interview is going to get worse and worse and worse. Well, happy to be in the midpoint. Thank you. Right. Cheers. Cheers. I love them. Way to go. <clears throat> Explain that grand time. Oh, okay. Cool. Abby is slacking every time, which is fine because. It's fine. You can vamp for a little while. Yeah, oh, God. This is where I stretch the term. Okay, yeah. This is where I stretch the term. While she's doing that, you want to crack a Mangalorian? Yeah. All right. So, yeah. Oh gosh! <laughs> oh, you went to the personal account. I thought you were going to the brewery. Yeah, account. No, no. Okay, right on. Why? All right. What? What is this? Like, I'm looking over. Well, and I see a lot of teeth, and you straightening to get away. So clearly, wait, 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 time out. Is this safe? or is this real? I mean, you know, I don't know if you've been to Isla. Oh, frick, I can't drop the. I can't remember the right name for Jurassic Park. Oh, it's killing me. Oh. It's dinosaur land in Winchester. Oh. Um, so. So that's not real. No. Oh, okay. 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 I survived a staged Velociraptor attack. Oh, it is staged. Um, so no, my wife and I would do trips on the Shenandoah in the fall, and uh, we saw this like super corny looking thing called Dinosaur Land. It was as corny as we dreamed it would be, and we had a blast. So and you almost got eaten by a Velociraptor. Well, I mean, I looked at one. I said, "Clever girl," and then the other. Oh yeah, don't say that. The Velociraptor. I don't like that. So, uh, Learn my lesson too. Yeah. yeah. Never say clever girl. I'm actually missing the right though. Yeah. Okay. Said it. Yeah. Gone. Horrible. Sucks. So yeah. Oh god, this is. I'm dreading every. <laughs> Why do I do it's this? It's funny because I want to speed you on to the next phase. Yeah, like, you, you are. are. You're like, like good god. I'm like, please don't do this. Don't do this. Oh god. Next one. All right. This is a pearl necklace, which is a band member. Um, it is a Chesapeake Stout hot sauce at a beauty chili sauce in Leesburg, Virginia. This question is, what is your favorite beer to drink while eating Maryland seafood? Okay. You know, it's funny, I, I, I heard you go through the last two interviews, and oh. both times I heard you say band member, like they were a member of your band. Yes, my... Yeah, you're a rock band. My and band. They're, they're part of it. No, they're band. They're, they're part of the band. Here we go, here we go. Dave, nope, you're doing it. Oh, are we uh, doing this? Everyone we're adding more. Oh, Every single one. I'm because in. I despise the way I feel as a human being. Great. Let's see if we can make that worse. We are going to make it. Oh, we're going to make it work. Sorry. Awesome. All right. So we're uh, doing this in the question? Uh-huh. Sweet. All right. Yeah. You ready? Come on. You can do it. Oh, boy. That was. <laughs> I don't know enough about oysters. But, um, okay. So favorite. Is it Maryland beer to drink with seafood? Or? No, any beer. That one's cool because it's like. It's almost like smoky. It's smoky. almost like bacon. Yeah. The I more, like I, the more I do this one, the more I, I buy like, that one for sure. What? I mean, by them all, thank you, everyone. Uh, no, that one in particular. That's good. Of course, though. Yeah. Hot scale. So, Flavor. I would typically, I mean, it's going to be a, uh, yeah, kind of an obvious answer from what I said before. I typically was drinking Pilsner while uh, enjoying seafood. This year, though, um, 1623 Brewing Company put out uh, everything but the seeds, watermelon, and green ale to die for. Really? Seafood. Absolutely to die for. I, really? I love it with wings, with crabs, with any, anything with some decent spice on it. It's amazing. And they won silver at GABF. Shout out, Maddie. For, uh, for that beer? For that beer, yeah. So I knew we'd won one for like a fruited beer, but I, I, I didn't know which one. Yeah, yeah. And, and it was really a, the 1623 watermelon cream ale. Amazing. That sounds, that sounds delightful. Good. And I'm not a huge watermelon guy, but that's really? amazing. I want to get some of that. Yeah. We should do that. We should yeah, just, 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 just go, let's go. I mean, what? It's only like 20 minutes. And you, want, you want to call it? Peace out. Let's go. No, I, don't, I don't care. But if I never eat hot sauce the rest of my life, I'll be totally fine. All right. Totally fine. <clears throat> Next sauce is the papaya. Okay. This is the one. That's the chunky one, right? This is the or chunky one. Thick. This is the one that it, it's, it starts to like turn for me. But in a very, very good way. And by when I say good way, good TV, and I'm really not happy with myself. Okay, so the question is, you think about doing this right now, but I don't know. Who is your brewery crush? <laughs> brewery crush? Yeah. Okay. I don't want to repeat my answer from... Four. I gotta think of another one. You can, you can repeat. Who is it? Should you point it off? Oh, I'm still mean. Woo. There it is, right? Yeah, right. That's good. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, if, it, if it's in state, I'll, uh, I'll go with Maine again. Because it's super clean styles. That's out of state. I'm sorry, out of state. <laughs> I, I, can, I can hear it. Yeah, I can hear it. 
Yeah. Right, we're in Maine right now. You know that? Uh-huh. Yep. Yeah. No, I, just, I, just, I, just, I have no idea where we are right now. Yeah. Here Sweet. I go. Uh, so, yeah. yeah. Out of state, Maine Beer Company. In state, just because they're super good dudes and they help Jesse out and I have a ton of other opening. Old Mother. Old Mother. Fantastic. Yeah. Great guys. Uh, I owe them a ton. They helped us so much in our early days. Um, yep. Oh, so God. Yeah. I just rubbed the hot sauce Don't do that in your eyes, man. Well, you know what? Here's the thing. Here's the thing about this. It sucks. Either way. What am I doing? I don't know. Why do I do this? Uh, this is delicious. Hold on, that's the next, oh, that's the next one. one. Oh, sweet. Yeah, oh uh, god. Shameless self promotion on the next one. Yeah. Uh, Death by chocolate. You know what? We have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing it. I am just. I must. I don't. I must not. I must want to kill myself. I don't know. Like. It's like, hey, how hot can I get? Jason, why? Uh, this smells delicious. Why am I doing this? Ooh, that comes out like water. Yeah, you gotta watch it. Oh, no, it's not water. Trust me. No, it's definitely not. Uh, well, okay. Not Maryland. What is your favorite brewery fire beer right now and why? <laughs> Look at that. Come on. What did I do? What, what, what did I do? I, 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 okay. Got it? Uh huh. That was all shell and hot sauce. Uh-huh. Yeah. There, there was something in there with what texture, but the rest was hot sauce. Woo! The Mandalorian by Brewery Fire is my favorite beer right now. Um, this is the way. Hey, buddy. Hi. What is this beer? It's a mango IPA. Um, it's kind of splitting the difference between uh, the East Coast and the West Coast IPA. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. Why is it called Mango? Uh, that, that word. Well, we were just going to call it the Mango variant of a different beer, but there. one of our awesome regulars was like, why don't we call it the Mangalorian? And yeah. like, well, until someone sues us, we will. Yeah, I would say the same thing. Why should they have to sue that? Yeah, why don't we just do that? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> F, F you. What'd you say, huh? You know all about that. I know all about that. We have a nice conversation CDs. about CDs. Yeah. 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 Well, CDs. Oh I haven't got one yet. What the F? Ah! <laughs> God. The mouse might be coming for us after this one, though. We'll see. I hope you get a CD. Sorry. Uh, I don't know if you're wishing me good or evil. Evil. Oh. Good, 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 good. good. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Why am I doing this? Look, guys. Okay. Around here, we like to add more because we're idiots. Uh, God, why are we doing this? This is Zanya Pop. Oh, God, my tongue is swell. All right, here. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of mine when you figure it out. Okay. Right. It's Zanya Apocalypse. Great. Uh, my torch bear. Do you want me to take care of yours, too? Or? I got it. Okay. You can do it. Here, right. just, you know. Do I love you or do I hate you? Uh, I don't know what you do right now. Yeah. Just, yeah. You, you hate me. You're a dick. Oh, my God. Who dead or alive? F you. Who, 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 <laughs> wait, wait, me or? F you off. Oh, all right, 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 right. <laughs> Who's dead or alive? Would you want to carry beer out for you? Like, you know, a thousand degree day? I can't even. Like, I think it's a 98 degree day. Yeah, it's, 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 it's Whoa. Okay. Here we go. Okay, who are you? Oh, I'm here. Look at the I don't know what that Let means. Let me help start, right? Oh, what know. the? Uh, I don't know, man. Maybe drink some aloe. It's like it gets hotter each each round. <laughs> you know, what would actually hurt less if I stuck my tongue in that outlet? It would probably hurt less than what I'm feeling right now. Want to try? Sure. Yeah. All right. Bring it over here. Yeah. Anyone have any beer copper? Uh, yep. So the question: <laughs> Going up and downstairs, the beer. On a hot day, who are you bringing? Who are you bringing? Okay. Dead or uh, alive. Dead it's, or alive. Uh, this is specifically uh, for my childhood best yep. friend, yep. who has a profound hatred of this person from personal interactions. So I should wait. F Elijah Wood. He's a, he's a tinier guy. Yeah, he is. So carrying him in a beer delivery would be more difficult for him. Unless he it's had the ring. And my buddy Matt would be so pleased to see him suffer. So, <sighs> so you're doing it for your buddy Matt? God, what the F am I doing? Maybe my buddy Matt and I got you to do this. Yeah. Thanks for coming. <laughs> Thank you again for watching. I'm going to keep on doing this until I die. Appreciate it. Remeshes.com